Audi and Porsche, developed the premium platform electric, which serves as the foundation for the Audi Q6 e-tron model. The 2025 Audi Q6 e-tron sits between the Q4 e-tron and the Q8 e-tron, with the goal of providing a solution for individuals who find the first too little and the second too large. The Audi A6 e-tron, and other future Audi EVs will be powered by the new premium platform electric, PPE, architecture, which makes its premiere with the Q6 e-tron. PPE architecture has a robust 800 volt electrical system for faster charging. The Q6 e-tron is anticipated to come with, a standard all-wheel drive engine that uses two electric motors, Audi is likely to refer to this configuration as Quattro. When it debuts in 2024, it will compete with other EV SUVs including the Genesis electrified GV70, Cadillac Lyric, and Lexus RZ. Audi is expected to use a similar trim level system, with premium, premium plus, and prestige trim levels available in regular SUV and tilted sport back body options. A dual motor, all wheel drive powertrain will most likely come standard, though a more powerful S model is still probable. The electric crossover will most likely include convenience features like, a wireless smartphone charging pad and keyless entry, as well as more opulent choices such as heated and ventilated seats and a heated steering wheel. The new Q6 e-tron's interior has been revealed by Audi, and it has several brand new innovations that aren't found in any other vehicle in the lineup. An 11.9-inch digital driver display and a 14.9-inch touchscreen infotainment system are housed in a single glass panel that encircles the driver. With their own 10.9-inch touchscreen, the shotgun user may help the driver with tasks like navigating the navigation system and switching radio stations. In addition, this screen has a privacy feature that lets the passenger watch films without bothering the driver. The 2025 Audi Q6 e-tron features an optional augmented reality head-up display. The Q6 e-tron's interior offers new luxurious looking upholstery options made from recyclable materials. If you choose the S-Line variant, you can select Dynamic or Nappa leather, which has a suede-like finish on the seats. The instrument panel finish options include wood, brushed aluminium, and painted metal. The all-wheel drive model generates 375 horsepower, which Audi claims is enough to go from 0 to 62 miles per hour in under 6 seconds. The performance-oriented Audi SQ6 pushes limits with 482 horsepower, while boost mode produces 509 horsepower. Audi's PPE platform uses an 800 volt design to generate extremely strong electricity. The maximum charging speed for an estimated 93.0 kWh battery is 270 kW, and Audi claims the battery can be charged from 10% to 80% in less than 30 minutes. While the longest range Q6 e-tron is expected to be good for roughly 372 miles in the European WLTP test cycle, the range between charges is likely to be around 315 miles. The Audi Q6 e-tron is expected to uphold the excellent levels of safety that Audi is known for across its entire car series. According to Audi, it intends to promote other automakers' use of this technology in the upcoming years in order to enhance safety via vehicle-to-everything connections. Advanced safety features found in Audi cars include airbags, emergency braking, adaptive cruise control, and lane-keeping assistance. Additionally, electric vehicles, such as the 2025 Audi Q6 e-tron, frequently benefit from strength and battery casings to improve safety.